Hello and welcome to City 7 News. Here are the headlines at this hour. UAE airports average almost 1,900 air traffic movements per day. Abu Dhabi taxi firm Q-Link to close by February 2011. Abu Dhabi's Emirates Palace unveils a 40 million dirham Christmas tree. The UAE General Civil, Civil Aviation Authority, the GCAA, announced that air traffic movements in the UAE grew at a rate of almost 7% in November 2010, compared to the same month last year. The GCAA monthly report indicated that in November 2010, there were over 56,000 total air traffic movements, with an average of almost 1,900 air traffic movements per day. This is the highest daily number of air traffic movements in the last two years. According to property consultants and brokers, Dubai property prices may drop for the next two years, extending a decline that's already cut values by more than 60% since the 2008 peak. According to the broker Landmark Advisory in Dubai, residential values may fall as much as 20% more by the end of 2012 if new homes are built. About 48,000 homes will come onto the market in the next two years, or about 12% of existing supply, according to Jess. Downs, Director of Research at Landmark. It seems there is still no parity between supply and demand. Abu Dhabi taxi firm Q-Link, one of seven Trans-80 taxi franchises, plans to close by February 2011. Al-Qudra, Q-Link's parent company, has concluded that transportation does not represent a key sector in the company's investment strategy in the current market environment. trans AD requirements state that a taxi company must maintain a vehicle count of 1,021 to remain operational. The company has been struggling to meet the quota since May, when it was reported that Q-Link had reached only about 300 vehicles. The taxi regulatory authority in the capital said that the closure will not affect the availability of taxis in the city. An Emirati camel has won a Gulf camel milking competition, beating rivals from Oman and Saudi Arabia. Pure blood camels from the Gulf participated in the three-day halab competition held in Abu Dhabi's western region with the aim of promoting camel milk. The UAE camel Daria won the contest after producing 11.7 kilograms of milk, followed by the Omani camel Hamra with 11.4 kilograms. The aim of the event was to promote the white gold of the desert as nutritious and drinkable even for those who are lactose intolerant. The contest was a prelude to Abu Dhabi's annual Al Dafra festival in which thousands of camels take part in a range of events including a camel beauty contest and races. Coming up later in the show, Abu Dhabi's Emirates Palace unveils a 40 million dirham Christmas tree. But up next, Laura Buckwell has the day's business news, so stay tuned.